Hey, what's up? This is Scott with the Level Up Tuts, and today we're going to start a new screencast series on Magento Community. And the Magento Community edition of their e commerce platform is really a great thing. It's an open source uh, e commerce platform that uh, is very heavily used. So, Magento offers just a really great out of the box features that in a lot of other content management systems or uh, even e-commerce specific ones you're going to have to build in yourself. Uh, not to mention they just do it in a really elegant way and it allows for all sorts of customization. There's plenty of themes, plenty of extensions online, and there's lots to learn. So if you have interest in learning Magento e-commerce, I suggest you watch this series. Um, we're going to get started in this first lesson, and this isn't technically the first lesson, this is going to be a 0.5 lesson. And what this is going to show you how to do is how to install the sample data that comes with Magento. And we're going to have this uh, sample data installed so that we can really paw through, you know, uh, Magento with data that they've given you instead of having to create a whole bunch of stuff just to show you what Magento's like. And I would suggest if you're new to Magento to even installing this sample data just to be able to see how things are done on your own. So to get started, just go ahead and click on this download and then community edition and it's going to take you to this page right here. And here's where you can download Magento. You, you want to select your format. You can just grab any of these um, and click download. And then just a little ways down here, there's sample data. And you're going to want to go ahead and download that as well. I've already downloaded both of those. And um, just so you know, I'm going to be running MAMP Pro. And uh, I don't know if you're familiar with MAMP or ZAMP or whatever. It's all pretty much the same. Or even if you're working off of a server, I'm working off of my local host. I have a folder. Um, that I have in my documents just called Magento and that's where all these files are going to live. So if you need any uh, help with MAMP or anything like that, you know, let us know. Maybe we can do a tutorial series on MAMP or XAMPP or any of those. Okay, so take some time and download those files and then come back and we'll get started. Okay, so now that you have the files, navigate to wherever they're downloaded and you'll see that they have them here inside of this sample data folder. We have an SQL file and we have a media folder. We're going to go ahead and we're going to upload that SQL file to a database that we need to create. So the first thing we want to do is we want to create a new database. Uh, if you get to your PHP my admin, you can just create a new database here and we're going to call this level Magento or level underscore Madge. Um, so this, you can call this whatever you want, whatever you're maybe naming your store as or something, just to let you know what database this is going to be. Click Create. Okay, so now we have our, our new database. And we want to import that SQL file into our database. So we're going to click Import here. We're going to choose our file. And we're going to browse to wherever that download was and then find this SQL file. We'll click Open. And we're going to click Go and that's going to import these tables into our database. Okay, so now that you have your database installed, you should see this um, import has successfully finished. So that means your tables have been correctly added. So the last step in this whole process is moving the sample media file into your Magento folder. Uh, we're going to cover that in the next video because we'll show you how to move your Magento folder to where it needs to go and finish the installation process. So in the next video, I'm going to show you how to actually install Magento and then we can get going. Once again, this is Scott with the Level Up Tuts. If you have any questions or comments, please leave a comment on the videos. Let us know what you're thinking. Let's, let me know what you want to see. Since this is a new series, I'm totally open to um, anything that people want to learn. Okay, uh, once again, thanks for watching. Bye.